First phase of the test, water flows into the pipes with the air valves closed. You can clearly see the air pockets created in the pipes. The W shape of the pipes was built to simulate field conditions where water lines are laid on sloping terrain. Currently, the data on the control screen indicates that to generate a flow of 17.1 liters per minute, the pump motor must run at around 550 RPM, which consumes energy at the rate of 9.2 watts per hour. Next, we open the ARI air valves, which release the trapped air in the system. Notice how the pipes now fill completely with water. At this stage, the data is transmitted to the controller. The controller then changes the current supplied to the motor in order to maintain the flow rate of 17.1 liters per minute. After the flow stabilizes, the control screen shows that now in order to produce the same flow rate of 17.1 liters per minute, the pump motor will run at 480 RPM, which consumes energy at the rate of 7.4 watts per hour. Notice the difference between the two energy consumption data results about a 20% saving. It's amazing. 